Hey guys, and welcome back. Well, did you hear that Brian McKnight's concert has been canceled? Yeah, now this comes right after he just uh, slammed his uh, children, his uh, four black children, uh, saying that they were evil and products of sin. Well, now it turns out that uh, his concert was canceled. Hmm. Maybe not enough ticket sales, because who goes to see Brian McKnight? Black folks, yeah. Well, although no official reason, such as scheduling conflicts or illness was given for the change, black folks online certainly seem to think it's his awful parenting to blame. Yes. Now, the shame cycle began when the show was announced on Facebook that it was immediately met with harsh backlash from users who weren't happy with the treatment of his older biological children. Now, the Back at One singer, if you didn't know, he recently came out on social media and called his children um, evil and a product of sin, and he even said his daughter he doesn't even acknowledge her existence yeah kind of evil yeah mm -hmm. well now he has a, a blended um anti-black family and he just had a child by his new wife and to make matters worse he even hated that this son could not be junior because he named his oldest son brian mcknight jr uh, brian changed his name so that his new child could be his junior yeah 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 but when the news of his show being canceled black twitter had a field day roasting him Mm -hmm. Now, uh, in the best reaction to the news, one uh, Twitter user uh, said, well, he's got a star back at one. And you know, that was one of his uh, songs he wrote. One, you like a dream come true. And you know, <laughs> I thought that was cute. He also said he's having a concert in one of the blackest cities while being anti-black. He forgot who his audience was, reminding McKnight how he became famous in the first place. Now, this person said, now his new tour dates should be in white states only, Idaho, uh, Maine, Massachusetts. And he said, let's see how far that goes. Mm. Now, another one used the meme of Bugs Bunny saying no after uh, saying, posting, do I ever cross your mind? You know, that was one of his famous songs, and uh, he had Bugs Bunny saying no. Mm -hmm. Now, meanwhile, someone spoke for the city of Detroit, writing on Twitter, saying, Brian McKnight, I'm coming de to Detroit. Then answering the comment with a meme of a door being slammed in a visitor's face. Mm -hmm. Well, Brian McKnight is finding out the hard way that you can only make so much of your personal family business public before people start taking sides. Now, only he knows why he insulted his children the way he did, but if he doesn't care about his relationship with his children, he definitely should care about his career, which may not recover from this scandal. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's a way to hit him, hit him in the pocketbook. And then his uh, lovely and correct new family. Let's see how how they uh, uh, take the news of a broke Brian McKnight. Mm, then he'll really see who's evil and who's not. <laughs> mm, what y'all think?